Welcome to Lecture 4. Now we will delve into an intricate aspect of surveillance operations, the equilibrium between technology and discretion. In a world increasingly veiled in digital eyes, the art and science of surveillance tread a fine line between innovation and intrusion. Let's commence by exploring covert surveillance techniques, a realm where discretion reigns supreme and the principle of least intrusive must be followed. Techniques such as using disguised or concealed equipment, like hidden cameras in smoke detectors, are one aspect of gathering information unobtrusively. These covert tools are invaluable in scenarios ranging from criminal investigations to corporate espionage, ensuring a layer of anonymity, thus minimizing operational risks. Tools like this are key to many kinds of investigation. Now, pivot to the role of technology. It has unequivocally bolstered surveillance capabilities. Terabytes of log data, hours of video footage, and sophisticated software analytics have expanded the horizon of what's possible, but also add to the clock in terms of investigation length. They offer enhanced monitoring, precise data analysis, and real-time responses, thus proving to be indispensable assets in modern surveillance arsenal, but also complicate and prolong an investigation. The more we lean on technology, the more we risk veering into the realm of over-reliance. A surveillance operation laden with high-tech equipment, but void of human discretion, could lead to ethical transgressions, misinterpretations, and a potential backlash from the public concerned about privacy infringements. Moreover, as technology advances, so does the sophistication of those wishing to evade detection. Hence, a cat-and-mouse game ensues, where surveillance professionals must continually adapt, balancing the scales of technology and discretion to ensure effective, ethical operations. Let's think of a simple example. How much equipment do you really need for a foot surveillance detail? In the most simple instance, none. If you are part of a well-funded, well-staffed team, the possibilities are endless. Only with experience and good judgment can an appropriate balance be found. A question to consider. What is needed to get the job done?